All right. It's a funny thing to say, but this, like, South by is loaded with people that are building apps and building theses, but don't know how to make money. I'm from Mom and Castle. Down the ground like gravel. Coming back around like lasso. Macro. Macro. Like a vision board, I see with clarity. I hustle like my name is Gary V. Sabas, I've been telling you. Accounts was talking about equity. I'm Triple H giving a pedigree. The meaning I'm special, my specialty. I put in the work till I'm dirty in the earth. I'm moving furniture to Beverly. You lost some weight. You're looking good. I'm impressed. I can see it. Uh, uh, yes. Okay. I'll see you there. I'm running late for something. Okay. I want, you know, why, why is the microphone on me? I'm always doing a vlog. It's called a vlog. How's it's that It's the work? future. Well, it's working quite well. It's the foundation of my future success. That's fascinating. Yeah, listen. Thanks for telling me. The future. You're welcome. Hey, Did great you to well? see you. I'm good. You? Oh, well, really yeah. good. What's that? I look forward to being on camera all night with you. Me too. Gary, yes. Nigel. Thank you, Nigel. Hey, you're How gonna get things? the shots in there. I'm gonna try, yeah, man. Yeah. Thank I you. See. That was good, right? So what? I have to speak for ten minutes for Comcast. How's it going so far? Good. Russ, baby, Russ. Good chatter. Good to see you. Nice to see you too. How have you been? It's been good. How are oh, well? you? Yeah. It's great to good. see you. Hey. How are you? Good. You guys know each other? I used to work at Vayner. She won the trip to Detroit. Yeah. <laughs> and, then, and then she was like, fuck that. I gotta go somewhere else because I am not going to Detroit. Uh, How are things? Good? I'm doing, doing well, yeah. Good, really good. Well. If I could ever be a help, let me know. Oh, thank you. All right? Good Appreciate to see you. It. Good You're to see welcome. you as well. Ready? Let's go. I love the recall. I know everything. <laughs> thank you. Guys, what about the epic, epic email town hall I did? What do you think? Epic. Sorry, Frank. Yes, good to see you. Hi. Hey, how Macau, you doing, Macau? My team, Jen, so nice Gary. Hey, uh, hey, Jen, Evan. Gary. Hey, hey Evan. How are you? What are you up to? I'm going to see Cam uh, Comcast right now. They're a client, so we're going to see them for a quick meeting. Uh, cool. Gave a keynote this morning. How'd it go? Really well. Gary B. What's up, man? Dude, good Q and A earlier. Thank you, brother. Can I get a selfie with you? Real of course. Quick? Thanks, dude. Safe travels. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Jason. How are you? I'm uh, doing well. I uh, saw you in there earlier. And Thank you. I'm a new fan. So Thank you. Along. It was really awesome what you said about being loud really pertains to me. So I'm going to try to do that. Good luck to you, man. Thanks a lot. Stay well. Thank you. Nice to see you. How are you? I'm good. Nice We're doing you. all this stuff here. Awesome. Hey, I'm Shira. Hi, Shira. Nice to meet you. Hey, Shira. This is really cool. Yeah, no. You did a nice yeah, job. Doing, yeah, it looks really oh, good. Can, are you on our mics? Okay. Is this At your daily times. vlog? Yes, it's my daily vlog. I watch vlog. it. Yo, you better tag me. <laughs> such a hustler. You tell me. This I call you. I know. You. Listen, I get I'm it. Teaching. I get I'm it. I'm learning. I get Seriously. it. How are you? Hi, come on back. Okay, I'm already mic for my vlog. I send that. Yes, I'm double mic. Mic chef. Yeah. My good. color. It's good How to doing, see man? you, man. How are you? Good, doing great. Oh well. I'm loving your Facebook stuff right now. Thank you, man. You know her? I know her. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I'm so good really good. You. Yeah, I love. We'll catch up. Sometime. I love to. Hey. Feeling good? Yes, sir. Thank you so much. My check. You're good. Good. I'm gonna, do you want a big uh, introduction? Oh, nope. Thank you. Nope. <laughs> sure not. I'm, I'm way too aware of this. Did you need water? To sign them, there's way too yeah, much. Yeah. I just don't have yeah. the time. I have but to no, so you But you give them out. Yeah, sure. She'll, She'll figure it out. Where's that? Yeah. It's fancy. It's a lot of cameras. <laughs> this is freaking me the fuck out. <laughs> So quiet. so quiet. So <laughs> quiet. Hey, brother. Good to see you. You well? Good to see you, man. Now, you're an influencer, you could say, but you're also a CEO, you're an entrepreneur, you're a businessman. How do you balance between your own personal brand and then, you know, being responsible to a company and employees and all that? I run my company. I'm the CEO of an 800 person, $130 million a year business and that takes up all my time. The Gary Vee thing is my side hustle. I have a team that records content in vlog form. We He's use, right here. who's okay. right somewhere, DRock. DRock Films, we make a vlog. In that, we have 18 hours worth of content that's happening. A lot of those turn into my medium posts. A lot of those turn into my meme videos. A lot of those turn into my, my audio podcast. I don't have time to build a personal brand. I don't, have a I don't have time. I live my life as an entrepreneur and I don't win on being attractive or funny. I win on being 
uh, an operator and being right about things that are happening and that's just my day to day life and then we produce it at home. But I spend all my time running my company and when I do public speaking, that's business development for VaynerMedia. It's a lot more fun to get a $3 million scope doing a keynote at the ANA than being part of an RFP process. That's just smart business. Yeah. What is someone supposed to do if they don't have a person to run around following them on camera? Do what I did for the first 30 years of my life. Build a business that allows you to afford one. <laughs> That's good advice. You know, like, I, look, I think this, sure. like I think a lot of people forget about my narrative because of my spiel in this, in this genre. I spent the first 15, 16 years of my life building an actual wine retail business before I even said one word to the world about my business thoughts. I didn't come out the womb and say I'm an influencer. I built an actual business and then I talked about building businesses. The thing I tell everybody in this room and people watching at home, like self-awareness is a big part of this as well. You have to know what you're good at and what you're not good at. The amount of people that have started video shows because they hear video marketing is good but they're scared to be in front of a camera and they're awkward, that's just not a good strategy. It's not your normal place. Like you have to know yourself and so even though the mediums were there, I could have been a blogger. I just knew that I couldn't communicate very effectively in the writing format and so I punted it, kept building a business and then when short form Twitter, when video for YouTube came out, I'm like, that I think I can do and that's what I jumped into. Physics of sales and it's, marketing. It's I've been simple. doing it for four decades. It's, I'm, I'm so much more old school than they think. No, but you got to. I mean, there's a lot of, sorry to oh. say it, kids which are a bit over simple. Simplistic about this. A hundred percent. Even even on stage, I've got to be more simplistic than I like because I don't have time oh, to go into and details. I think, but you need to use their yeah. sort of crass language yeah, exactly. to get the message across. So. Real nice to meet you. Take care. So South by is going super well. Um, just had a great client meeting. Were you in the client meeting? Yeah. Comcast? No. Great client meeting. Uh, and um, great keynote. It seems like people are really enjoying it. D Rock even liked it, which is rare and exciting. And uh, I didn't play super well in basketball. I didn't play well at all. That's right though, haven't been on the court for nine months. Gonna work on that. And then um, did some Vayner Sports recruiting, which was fun. Can't show that. Hey. Hey. My name is Joe. Joe, how are you? I'm also a fellow New Yorker. I've Very nice, man. You guys, uh, uh, since back in the day when you were Thank you, brother. throwing good shit up on the, <laughs> the tube. Thank you, man. Uh, I actually follow you on Snapchat, too. Thank you, man. It's been crazy to see your evolution. Thank you. Uh, awesome, man. I'm running late for so something. Right, I'm glad you said you. hello. Thanks. Good luck to you. Take care. Yo! What's up, guys? Can I shake your hand to yes. all you in Vegas? Yes. Facebook. Thank you. Real pleasure Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet How you. are you? Sorry. Good, no worries. Yo. I recognize you from the back, son. <laughs> <laughs> no worries, man. What's up, man? Good to meet you, man. You guys, you guys hustling? You loading yeah, up some yeah, trucks? Yeah, We're here man. DC, Real man. fucking workers. Yeah, yeah, I love it, man. Trying to yeah, yeah. be like that. I love it. Yeah, hey, can we get a Yeah, picture? let's do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know how to operate that broke iPhone? Hell yeah. <laughs> sure. He is a broke iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> let me get a, uh, let me get a uh, yeah, wild one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, awesome. All right, guys. Hey, Take hey. care of yourself. You too, man. Thank you. Great meet you, man. Thank you, man. Hey, Take bro. care of yourself. Stay well. Super busy. Where are you, Ben Lair? Can't find you. But I'm pushing practicality. You know, we've got eight years of a good economy. Like, this world of ours, and this is, I mean, if you're here, you're ambitious, you know what's going on in the new world, you're hyped, you've got a lot of energy, you're entrepreneurial, you're a risk taker. The problem is, for, when I look at this crowd, there's so many young people who've never lived through the punch in the mouth. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I've lived through the punch. <laughs> Trust me. So after eight, you know, after eight great years in our economy, I just, I want people to pay attention to actually making money. You know, users and engagement and followers, those are, you know, lifetime value, CAC, all this stuff that people talk about in the startup world is all nice and dandy, but if your business is not making money each month and it's losing money, you're not gonna be raising money when there's none out there. And so I'm pushing practicality. It's boring, but it's tried and true. Looking to, to acquire and something and invest, what do you look at? In this world, in the South by world, I look for the jockey over the horse. So I'm looking at, does she have the fire to change her business nine months in when the market changed on her? So in startup land, it's hard. Let me tell you guys how all to make money. No joke, if you're sitting on money, every person here should invest in Facebook 
And then when the world melts in nine months and the stock's in half and you hate me, don't sell it. Just hold on. Because I promise you in nine years, that investment's gonna return you a fuckload of money. So that's the slow double or triple your money bet, but that's kind of better than the fucking zero interest you get in the bank. The, the way to make crazy money is to only bet on the jockey because they've got to pivot, they've got to adjust. You know, the operator, the pilot, she and he is the one that's gonna dominate and win because the reality is these startups are so young and early, like Facebook looks nothing like what Facebook looked like nine years ago. He made a bunch of adjustments. Like this shit changes and you've got to be used to that. Spotify had to adjust. Birchbox has to adjust. Like, like everybody's navigating and just raising capital or looking the part. So I'm looking for somebody who can get punched in the mouth, spit the blood out, and move forward. Yeah. Right you see, see that right there. Got it. I like that. I like, I like that. that. And again, looking at the demo, you have to be the architect and the plumber, right? And the mason and the garbage person. Like, like the thing that I have a lot of pride in is I can come on and talk all high level and then when somebody calls me to the mat like you did, so the reason I love you is I do a lot of shit and I just pontificate and nobody calls me to the mat and we run out of time and I leave. You called me to the mat, I'm like okay. And, but what I'm excited about is that's my best moment because if you want to go into details, I'll get so finite into that detail. So to me, the one thing I would pride myself in as you grow in your business. As you grow, the thing that I have the most pride in is VaynerMedia now has 800 employees. Not one of them that works for me does as much actual social media as I do. I'm still, by far, and that's why, but probably the biggest reason my side hustle is Gary V is because it keeps me grounded in actually the doing of the shit that I'm doing. And what happens to a lot of people as they grow, they get away from the work and they become a manager and then they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Ah, what's up, guys? How are you, man? How are you? Good to see you. Good, man. Good to see like you. Life good? Life is great, man. Good, man. Great, Excited man. to do this. Yeah, for sure. I love it. I mean, you're you sitting down on, on, on the back. Yeah, we're going to go chill. Perfect. Yeah. yeah, what up, Envy? What's up, sir? Good to see you, my man. Good to see you, as always. How are you? Good to see you, man. Heard a voice. Still some trouble in Maine. Trying. Trying. Watch your head. Watch your head. So everything good. He's still making boy still making some cash on the side, he flipping. Is, he is. He's doing, you know, you know he's doing that? He's making slime and selling slime. Yeah, slime's yeah. killing. Yeah, That's my, killing. My my my, my, my sister, my daughter too. Yeah. The whole what is what how old is he? He is uh, twelve now. Yeah, oh, just all, all the eight year olds. So he goes to school with his, this slime. And he sells it. The other day he came home with $120. I had to check his bag. I'm like, I'm like, You're like what, what are you slinging? He's like, slime, Dad. Like, slime. Uh, when I'm gonna just introduce everyone at the same time, and then when I finish, I, I those are the, those are the ones I like, so, right? But I haven't, I haven't seen that cutter. No, that's not the one you have. That's what you yeah. like. No, no, it is. It is the one I have. But it's a dude. So awesome. Real pleasure, my man. Thank you. Remember, so you said. Document. We did forty thousand dollars in the next ninety days. People, people think I'm making up shit. You just gotta hey, execute. All I'm saying is, it's yeah. it, like it took a lot of sweat, right? My boy Vic is upstairs. He'll, Good shit's supposed to take work. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's. I know. We gotta sucks. go. All right. My bad. We'll talk later, bro. I just wanted to say I'm, thank that you, makes me very, very happy. first and foremost. Thank you, brother. Like, thank you, brother. Oh yeah, yeah. 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 Thank you, guys. Now we're closing. What's up, man? Closing? 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 It's 2017. Let's go out and get some fucking money. <laughs> <laughs> Gary V. Gary V. God, fuck. That was perfect. I, I, you know, I, I would say let's go make some actual money because shit's about to hit the fan and have, making money is a very good strategy. All right. It's a funny thing to say, but this, like, South By is loaded with people that are building apps and building theses, but don't know how to make money. <laughs> Give it up for Gary V. and Jarrell. Oh, yeah. Great job, I'm gonna get this again. Oh, no, you, 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 you gotta get some pointers, <laughs> <laughs> man. Man, I love you so love much, you man. Back. Yeah. Good stuff. Bye, Bye guys. Good. All right, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> You're welcome. What are you trying to get out of South by Southwest? Why do you even show up? I show up for two core reasons. One, 
There's just a shitload of people here. Can I curse on boards? Nope. Okay. <laughs> There's just a lot of people here. Just beep that last part. And just even having this and shaking hands and meeting people that you only get to see once in a while. And two, a lot of my business associates congregate here. So I did 11 meetings today that would have taken me four months to schedule. And I did them all in one afternoon. So it's actually efficient for me to show up to South by. So, so people will like sometimes confuse you, you being loud. I'm loud. And confident. I'm confident. With like being obnoxious or whatever. Yeah. So what scares Gary Vee? Like, you know, you go to sleep at night, what scares you? The health and well-being of my family. And that's, that's it. And that's what keeps you going. 100%. When it comes to business, I know that I'll end up being historically correct. I'm empathetic to somebody seeing me curse in a video like this or act too proud and they'll be like, he's full of hot air. They're either gonna be right or I'm gonna be right in 20, 30 years. And I know what my intent is. I'm not trying to hurt anybody's feelings. I understand that my jerseyness might be too crass for somebody, but I'm not gonna change who I am because of the way you see the world. I have respect for the way you see the world. Have some for me. So you're about to share it like with right? three other people, right? Okay. What do you pick? Uh, I would pick my two dead grandfathers because I never met them and I would pick Randy the Macho Man Savage who also is dead because he's my favorite all-time wrestler. Last question. Yes. When was the last time you were humbled? I'm humbled every day. Humbled? Humbled. I'm humbled every day. Being an entrepreneur is humbling 24-7, 365. Don't get it twisted. For all my bravado and all my ego, I live on humility because I'm losing every second there's problems. I got 800 pro- By the time I got off stage just now, I have 800 humbling moments in my phone right now. When you run big companies, you're humbled all the time. I love being humbled. I enjoy being humbled. That's part of the process. This week's gonna be fucking insane, dude. Why? Fucking Blizzard coming in Tuesday. You're speaking in it. You're not speaking. Gary speaking in SF <laughs> Wednesday. Salt Lake City Thursday. Uh, all hands Friday. A ton of internal shit going on. He was supposed to be in Austin Tuesday. We cleared that out. So now we have a full day to work with. 